What's up, everyone? What's up, guys? We're Welcome here. Welcome to a special coverage of the tournament. We're here at uh, Matsuri Khan Matsuri 2018. Matsuri Khan! Don't say it like that. It's freaking weird. Yeah, you missed the pirate. Huh? Huh? You missed pirate. I missed what? I missed pirate. There was a pirate year? Yeah. Oh, oh man. Yeah, we missed pirate year. So what's the theme this year then? Yeah, what is the theme this year? Uh, fantasy something. Yeah, we're at fantasy year Monster at Matsuri Kung. Is that fantasy so, or just fantastic? Yeah. So we're going to be covering the tournament. Um, the tournaments over the weekend. We're going to be doing the pro tournaments. Um, there's going to be another crew here doing the AM tournaments. The AM. Or the morning. I think it really. stands for amateur. <laughs> oh. Pro is for professional. Well, aren't you just an uh, am? Nope. Okay. Great pro right here. Um, so, uh, you know, we're just going to be covering the tournaments. It, it's, it's a nice little extra stream slash recording. We're going to be put, putting these up on the MatsuriCon uh, YouTube. We're also going to be putting them up on our YouTube, which you're probably watching right now. Or you're watching on Twitch as a rerun, whatever. But... Yeah, if you don't yeah. know of us, we are Dose of Nerd Acumen. We are for Dose of Nerd Acumen. You guys enjoying the convention now, or post convention, looking back on your highlights and memories from it. We hope you had fun because you'll be watching it afterwards at this point. Yes, sir. So we wish best of luck to everybody. And uh, have you have you played any fighting games, really, Travis? Have I? Yeah, actually. What, um, uh, what do you play? Because the, the first game up we're going to be doing is um, a little bit of Tekken 7, I believe, right? Tekken, I did grow up playing. Tekken 7 is not one that I personally played. Something good However, happened. some of the other ones that were covered earlier was Injustice 2. I, I do oh, love yeah, the Injustice yeah. series. We did, Personally, fact, I might be biased here, but I'm looking forward to Smash. I, I I'm looking forward you. to Smash. I'm looking forward to Street Fighter V for the most part. And we did um, cover that in a weekly dosage. We did cover A2 that in Brandon, weekly shout out. Yep. Um... We did unfortunately miss the Injustice 2 tournaments as we were running late because the president was in fact in town, so he decided he wanted to take up all of the space for us to park and drive. So all of the it. space, all of the space. <laughs> um, so we parked, we got here, we got here as fast as we could. Something else good happened just there, and you're missing it. So uh, we're just gonna hang out and chit chat until we get the next uh, next two folks up here to to take their turn on the catwalk. Yeah, yeah, on catwalk. The catwalk. It's yeah. Mr. Producer, Seducer. We have uh, we have Locksteady over to the side, seducing the, and producing. You wanna wanna peek in behind us, say hello to the, to the ladies. Uh, give a little peek, peekaroo. We got Locksteady back here. So as you can see with his badge, we got this fancy dancy thing right here. I don't have a name. I am nobody. We're all no names. No names. But as you can see below me, I am right. If we do this, then okay, it's oh, yeah. part of my thing. See, we have names. It's true. They don't fit on our name tags, but it's okay. because we're too big. Um, too now famous. today, today is Friday. What's today's date? Oh yeah, the twenty fourth. It is the first day of the convention. So, um, unfortunately, we're only going to be covering this. Uh, this this coverage is only supposed to last maybe a couple hours because we did come into the last portion, the Tekken Seven portion. Um, Producer, could you tell us what the uh, tournaments are tomorrow, please? Because <clears throat> I didn't pull it up. I don't have my other hangouts on here. Cool. So tomorrow, what do we got? So tomorrow, Saturday, we're going to be doing the Pro Series for... We have, what did we decide? Did we decide which ones? Definitely Smash. We're going to open up with yep. that tomorrow. Smash is going to be <clears throat> tomorrow, Saturday the 25th. Um, I mean, I guess you don't need to know the times because this is live. <laughs> right. So we're going to be doing Smash. Uh, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball Fighter Z, and then Street Fighter V. So stay tuned for those. Those will be coming up when we make a playlist for those, so you guys can watch them back. Um, well, you're probably already on the playlist, so you're already. Yeah. Okay. Everybody so. here is going to be getting uh, one of these lovely cards. Look at that! To go it's not with flipped. Them. <laughs> it's not flipped. To go with them, so that way they can watch themselves back if they so choose. Yes. So with that, we're going to actually switch over to the first match that we have. Um, so as you can see here in the corner, they're getting set up. We have a little player cam down over there. 
<laughs> These are pro tournament These are fighters. Pro tournament fighters. Um, now, if we're being completely honest, I don't know too much. I've never commentated a fighting game. I've only watched like Evo, uh, Evo and uh, Capcom Pro Tour a little bit. So I don't what. So just make it up. So yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah they're kicking. Famous. They're kicking. In, they're kicking the heck out of each other. It's true. They are gonna kick the heck out of each other. Kicking the heck out of each other. So we got our uh, producer Locksteady setting up with the names and everything, so that way we can get that going. Um, Rob, Rob, oh. Rob. Oh. <laughs> He's trying to sit up. He's, he's busy. Sit there so wait for him to watch it. So no, I mean why? Like they want to see oh. what this looks like. When we're using it. What he should do, honestly, yeah, is sit on the other side. You, sh you should sit on the other side so they can see that. We've gone too far. We've gone oh too far. God. Tomorrow, then. That's what wait, you're wait, doing wait. tomorrow. Oh, yeah, we'll, we need to watch this. No, you know I mean, essentially, we could put and have here. them behind us. That might actually be interesting. Mm, I don't like it. Well, not for this one. Not for this one. We might do that tomorrow. Tomorrow it might look different for uh, tomorrow. Match, we but sure. <laughs> sure. We're, gonna, we're getting ready here for the first match. Here we got Posh X versus McCray. The X is silent. X is always silent. Right, Come cool. on, now. I, I dig it. It's silent X's. It's because the name was already taken, right? Yeah. See? And you didn't want to put, put numbers. numbers. In mind, so no numbers. Yeah, no numbers. Screw the numbers. Yeah, X, <laughs> X's are always silent. I get yeah. it. <laughs> Especially when they're named Jennifer. <laughs> I don't know. I just wanted to pick a girl's name. Jennifer? Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer Lopez. <laughs> so, right, we got Posh versus McCray. No, I, I'm not 100% sure because we're kind of not completely up to uh, up to snuff on the rules here. B1, but uh, B2. I think it might be best two of three. McCray oh. starting out with the advantage. He's not going to showing Not giving him any here. time to recover. Almost falls victory. We have some damage now on Miguel. That flash Nita trying here. to play safe, playing, playing back with offensive oh, game here. But we get a KO well, there, and Miguel takes the lead. That is the victory. Knockout. We got one round from McCray over here. Alright, coming out on the advantage though, Nita with the first strike. We have Miguel there, or McCray if you will. Uh, Nita again playing defensive strategy. It's not their favorite. The fun thing about these, about this fighting game other than others, is that it's a, it's a 3D fighting game, so you have the ability to dodge left and right. Um, along the x-axis, y-axis, as well as the z-axis, so they have plenty of plenty of ways to get away, but it looks like Posh is having a difficult time doing so. Posh still playing the defensive game, playing a smart strategy. However, just gotta, just gotta wait for your opening. seems to be on the advantage of McCray's character there, and a KO, that's oh, two straight KOs now for McCray. Round yeah, three here. Match point for McCray here. So Posh coming out, trying to bait them in. Again, the reach advantage blocks that. Nina getting hit with the first strikes there, Miguel on the advantage. Nina coming back. Uh, McCray not letting anything in, oh, he goes with the grab. And we have more strikes here. Nina showing an advantage the first time in this trio of matches. However, McCray turning things around now. Striking advantage with combos. Looks like he's showing his dominance. We have now Nina attempting, but blocks left and right, reading those hits. Fly. Now we're getting a combination maneuver going in. Alright, playing it safe, both waiting and tempting. Switching to a defensive strategy here. Blocking left and right, reading each other's moves like they've read that book before. We have now Nina trying to get the advantage, waiting. Oh, well, another grab. And Posh. grapple. Over a special maneuver. Oh, Nina, that. Nina can take this thing. And block. Oh, Posh getting a KO over here. Posh over here. So 1 2, McCray leading saying, this thing. I'm saying over here a bunch. <laughs> you are saying over here. That's okay. It's good to say so, over here. Starting off with the advantage, McCray. Uh, combination, right half damage, almost 75% with this combination. Yeah, he's good to set up the end of this blocking. Posh gets the strike. Come back here. And KO oh, McCray yeah. takes this trio. Three to one. For McCray. Three to one. Oh, hey Rob. Rob. Lock steady. We're going back to a character select. Can you, can you ask them if it's um, two out of two out of three or three out of five? All right, little uh, little info for the matches. We are uh, doing two out of three. So McRae leading us one one zero in the two of three. They sure he's got three. nine wins up there. Well, exactly. <laughs> just because they keep the game running. <laughs> Ignore what? that count. Right. For tournaments, that's generally the uh, the way they do things here. We are getting game audio, correct? 
Awesome, fantastic. It's not too high, not too low. How is the commentary volume from both of us? Good levels? Oh. Yeah, I'm going to keep that. Do we have good levels, Rob? Good levels? For us? You think so? You're listening. <laughs> he doesn't. Okay. Listen. My opinion is yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So we have a character select. We're going with the same characters here. We're going Miguel and Nino. Starting off strong is McCragan with the advantage to the reach. I, I truly think that's a favor for this particular character. Uh, trying to play the defensive style, the counter strikes here. But reading through it is McCray's character. Hush. And we see the advantage of the combination setting up the end of this first Anna KO. Hush going down to McCray. Yeah, that looks good. See. Fantastic. Yeah, looks good. Our second round here. In the best of three McCray. series. McCray up one round on Hush. Playing the bait game. Defensive strategy. Oh, look at that counter by McCray. Good Heavy strike. Overhead. So nice combinations. The the leg kicks from Nina, Tasha's character here. Uh, if they can land them, I think it would be effective, unfortunately. I think if you land anything, it'll be effective. <laughs> well, truly. To be honest here. Truly. And it's all about the combinations in the scenes in this. Tosh now turning it up with the combinations, landing. Oh, the counters. Incredible moveset here, play back to the defensive strategy, right and oh, oh, he comes back. close. Comes back from yeah. a low. McCray the advantage, low two up effect. on this one. If McCray takes this one, they take the entire match. Combinations to start off here, Posh and Control. McCray looking to bait them in though. Posh with the combinations, landing, going in, landing that. Nice combinations. Posh on the advantage, could have a flawless, perfect win here for Posh. Incredible third match. And round four begins here. We have McCray starting off in the advantage. Uh, already McCray oh, needs to, yeah. to pick it up, or Posh needs to pick it up. Combination wants left to come back right. in this match. Into the back corner, this is not a good spot to be. However, the strike back, blocking the combinations. Posh needs to play a little more aerial tactics that I notice here in this. Very well grounded. Another KO. McCray right. takes the Looks best. Looks like McCray takes the three. first. So congratulations. First match here of uh, of our of our coverage. Right. Looks like McCray. What? Why'd you do that? So oh, we just trans cool. transition back. That could be our transition. So here we are still live from, not live with you, but we are here We're in person. We're with you here at Matsuri, uh, 2018. We are here alive. For the uh, Tekken 7 Pro <laughs> tournament here. Impressive. Uh, what do you say? I mean, I are you a Tekken, Tekken no, gamer? No, I am not very good at Tekken. I would. Did you ever play them? Though? My strategy in Tekken would be to wait for you to try to kick me, and then I move, like, left or right. So you play the bait. Yeah, so I would you try go, to bait them in. Dodge and then just strike. I mean, that's what we ultimately saw there from Posh. They were trying to lure them in, play a defensive game. Yeah. And I truly think the advantage was in that character's reach, but not knowing in depth about the meta of the characters themselves, yeah. I, I, from an observation mm -hmm. standpoint of that character, uh, reach was definitely in that character's favor. Yeah, and I do think once uh, once we get more into <coughs> the the games that we know a little better, uh, unlike Tekken, unlike Tekken Seven, unfortunately, we don't know too much about it. We haven't played very much of it. Um, when we get to games like Smash and uh, Street Fighter Five, we will know a little more about those, so we can. I feel like it'd be a little more natural for us to uh, to kind of commentate those a little better. But even so, I mean, you're watching them play a game. That's fun. You're listening to us banter. What could hurt, right? <laughs> Enjoy. <clears throat> so what uh, what are you looking forward to this weekend? I know we got the tournaments going on, but... Uh... Honestly, uh, there's a lot of cool vendors that I'm really intrigued in checking out. Um, a lot of anime vendors, a lot of board game vendors. I'm not a... And this is surprising for me to say, because as you guys may know, if you know me, I'm not a big board game guy, but I am intrigued to see what they have. Because um, ultimately, I would personally love to see board game content on DNA's channel. Yeah, so what right. do you guys think? Uh, um, I would, but the we question wanna, is for you. I want to give a shout out actually to Pat, 
Um, one of the reasons why we're we're here. Um, yep. Shout outs to uh, Pat and the Matsuri Khan staff for allowing us to come do this here. This the reason I ultimately bring him up, not just for that, but from my my observation, he is a um, board game connoisseur. Board game connoisseur, I'm, board game enthusiast. Enthusiast, yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong there, Rob. You would know a lot about that. Um, I've been pitching and tossing around the idea to have that type, you know, that type of content here on DNA's channel. So it, it's something that I would ultimately, you know, love to see. So. All right. So next up, we have uh, I believe we have the winners finals coming up. If I'm listening correctly. Oh, nice. <laughs> But I think they might be on a different, uh, different setup. Gotcha. Now there is an idea. Speaking of board games, um, if you're watching this before our weekly dosage 50th episode, which we just aired at this point, <laughs> our 47th. Uh, but if you're, if you're if you're watching before our 50th in the coming weeks for us right now, um, we've been tossing around the idea of cards and humanity. Yep. So we're, there will be a NSFW. <laughs> Not safe for, for anyone. Yeah, NSFA. Stream. Yes, not safe anywhere. Not safe anywhere. NSA. NSA, not We're safe anywhere. NSA. So yeah, it's the NSA stream. Yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah. Shh. Yeah, see, he knows. Shut he up. knows. McCray knows. The <laughs> NSA. Jeez. So, I think ultimately that'll be a true test to see if that's something that's in... in engaging with you guys yep. and fun for you to watch um, ultimately it's just another opportunity for us to make asses of ourselves oh, which yeah. you guys seem to enjoy so we keep wanting to deliver that type of content and of course to see Rob's shiny red face on cam that's what it's all about <laughs> it is what it's all about lock steady the red face producer Ooh. I was oh, trying to stretch my legs and just nailed the camera. Nailed it. Now I'm. You're in. You're in the vine. Not to be confused with vine. It's true. So as I mentioned, this uh, this stream is going to be a little, or not stream, this recording, this video is going to be a little shorter than the others of the weekend because uh, this weekend or tonight we are doing just Tech and Seven, which it looks like they are putting the winners finals on another uh, system. I'm not quite certain why, but we'll kind of give you uh, coverage of the winner here soon. What you say? Are we not really doing the winners over here? Carlos is not here. Anymore. He's not here anymore. That, that girl's right here. Yeah, they left us. You might have to ask her to put them over here. Yeah, if you need to step down. We're saying a step away. We can talk. We can talk to the people. It's true. We talk to you. We're, We're talking we're to those people. Right here. We're here. We're here. It's Archer, you're the producer, seducer. You're, you're sitting on your phone. Yeah. Get up. What are you doing? doing? What? Talking what to Kevin? No, I'm not talking to Kevin. Hi, Kevin. Hi, Kevin. Hi, Kevin. Hi, Kevin. Hi, Kevin. You're not gonna watch, so hi, Kevin. Okay. One of the big things about a con, take your vitamins, because con flu exists. And drink plenty of water. Because what's the average attendance for these things? Like in the thousands? 8,000 or so this year? This one's between 7 and 8,000. 7 and 8,000? Mm -hmm. So con flu is a thing because you all got germs, and I guarantee like 40% of y'all don't wash your hands. <laughs> now, this wouldn't be a convention without costumes. And I only say that because I want everyone to stay healthy so we can continue to go to these things. I don't so, mean it in a mean, degrading way. I will, in fact, be Finn for the rest of this. Finn? Finn, the Finn, human. Finn Balor? Finn the human. This thing is really hot, though. Is that from Adventure Time? It is from Adventure Time. Oh, I knew that one. My eight-year-old brother watches breast. that. You said you're, you're a breast? Also, yes. You have breasts? <laughs> he said I'm a breast. Where is he? Where are you going? That's not the way. No. <laughs> he abandoned us. He just went out the room. It's not the way to... He left us. What do we do? We have lost the producer. Help us. <laughs> we're a producer. Us. We don't know what to do. So, we are looking for a new producer. If you have an Alienware laptop, <laughs> and know a little bit about OBS, 
Actually, your laptop works. That's true. If you know how to click a mouse yeah. to scene transition, we want you. Whoa. Or this one. We want you. See? Yeah. See? You got everybody. <laughs> Anybody can do it. I don't see why anybody. Can. So I, I think that if we have the back to us, I think that it act as a really good backdrop, to be honest. You think so? I do. I think that should be a backdrop for because this so, background looks just kind of like we're yeah. And you know what we could do? We could move these tables against the wall. Right. You have to give us more room. Mm -hmm. I think we should. Do well, that. well, we'd have to keep them a little bit away from the wall to have the cameras. Well, that one I'm saying we can move this one. We still have yeah, to have can. the camera out in front of us. Oh right. Yeah. I'm just saying, just keep it like a couple feet from the wall. Yeah. I, I think that's a good idea to try. Move out. both of them so that way Rob can sit next to them too. Right. We're just figuring out what we're doing because we got here late. So, yeah. So we can't really tell what's going on with the match, but uh, when the results come in, we'll give you a little so bit. So let's of recap it. Our, yeah. our, our day so far. Yeah, let's do it. So, woke up this morning. I woke up late because my alarm didn't go off. did. I worked past my normal hours. I was supposed to get out at noon, but um, in a fortunate turn of this, I didn't have to use as much vacation time because y'all yeah. were late. Yep. So only like what a half hour? Maybe uh, an hour? Forty minutes. Forty minutes. Yeah. So you have, you have like half a day and twenty minutes of vacation. Yeah. Like. Yeah. I still have. I took four and a half hours and I ended up only using three and like forty minutes or something. Whatever the math is. Math is hard. I don't know. Math is hard. So. I feel like I should be chatting my phone too. What's happening? Uh, Maybe you should open it to read it. I can read it. They're they're asking us how we're doing. So our drive down here was what about three, three and a half hours? Three and a half hours because we hit heavy traffic in some areas. Yep. And for some odd reason, uh, GPS had us get off randomly in a town off the highway. So GPS had us get off a highway, zigzag through a town, like literally turn right off the highway. Turn left onto another street, turn left onto another street to get back on the highway. Yeah, it didn't make any sense. But we got to see, wasn't that the stop that we saw the uh, clock tower that looked like? Oh yeah, we saw a clock tower that looks like the, the clock office. tower from the intro to the office. Yeah, so that was kind of neat. Um, it was actually really creepy. It looked a lot. Like really. And then we got down here and circled the city about two to three times because it was barricaded off because um, our POTUS is here. So we couldn't get into our hotel parking lot. We had to park at a different hotel's parking lot. Yeah. And then walk down. Um, and then we had to wait for uh, Mr. Potty because he had to go. Yeah. Did you did you commit a crime today, sir? I did. What kind of crime did you commit? Fashion crime. Fashion crime? Yeah. We have some talking going on in the crowd. There is, there are some things going on. I would have loved to know that because then I would have sent somebody on. People are talking and figuring out ideas and details. I'm just telling them that people are figuring out details, but I'm doing it in my radio voice. I feel like I should whisper I feel like I'm redlining when I do that. Uh, I don't think you are. You're still in the yellow one. Ooh, we're getting close though. How does my voice sound really close? We're gonna do it. We figured it out, ladies and germs. I said we figured you, it out. You should put on the headphones what so you can hear us. What did I miss? What did we miss? You, I thought you figured it out. Yeah. You figured it out, and you're part of the we. Oh, okay. Um, okay, let me see if I can figure it out. Is it, is it picking me up? I can't. Okay, I can't really hear me. I'm going to get closer. So, basically, it seems like what happened is somebody decided there were two oh, for us to all get sent to one station. So that dude is also doing pro as well. So Carlos was sending him some people and then sending us some people. That's and then dumb. he had to leave to go run a panel and proceeded to not tell the person he told to take over that we were doing this at all. So she wasn't sending people to us. Those people that came over and played just happened to come over and choose the station. 
That's cool, man. Right. So we're going to cut this. <laughs> I don't want this uploaded to the YouTube. That's on you. Don't forget. Make a I'm mental note. the whole thing as is. Hey, whatever. It's not our So fault. we're not uploading this, what we just did? You can cut, trim it. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to trim it. Okay. So basically at this point, you can hit stop recording. And then we'll start it back up and say, welcome back. This is part two.